Okay, so this is a recording to go through the data download uh, data download steps for CAS 170. Hope you find it as fun as it was uh, making it. Okay then. Uh, so first thing you want to do is open up Firefox. Make sure it's Firefox. Internet Explorer will not work. Okay, when you get Firefox opened. Then go up to the address, type in tiny.cc backslash capital C A S 170. Enter, which will take you to the class website. Then you scroll down over here and click on data files download, which takes you to the book companion site, which has all this other stuff, if you ever want to do that, also flashcards, practice test, all that stuff. Uh, <coughs> but um, what we need uh, for now is <coughs> the data files for students. Click that. Now, for some reason, they broke this up. Um, so you're going to need both of these eventually, but the steps will be identical. So I'll just do one of them at this time. So here's um, Excel chapters 1 through 3. So you click that button to download. You'll get this pop up. And you do want to say save file. And it goes through that process. Close that out. Then go down to your library down here. Then the downloads. And it should be this top one here. Actually, it looks like it's this one, sorry. That must be an old one, yeah. So it'll be the one you just uh, you just did anyway. So this was just as of now. All right. So double click on that and run. Now here's the important step: make sure you get it going to the right place. So um, we want it on uh, your flash drive, let's say. So browse. And you go find your flash drive, and I need mine my flash dry because. You only have so many letters. Um, you can name it whatever you want, or don't name it anything. It's whatever it is. But in any case, find it. Click on that. OK. And then unzip. And we'll go through the process. So three files unzipped, which will be chapters 1, 2, and 3. So close that. Close that. Close that. Close that. Don't need that anymore. OK. <clears throat> now they're still going to be zipped. They're sort of a zipped file within a zipped file. So we'll go down here and uh, go back to your flash drive, and you'll see those chapters one, two, three, which are still zipped. So you still need to unzip those so you can access them from Excel. So uh, the steps for all these will be identical. You go on to the first one, right click on that, hit extract all. If this box is checked, uncheck it so it looks like that. And then this will default into the same folder. Click Extract. We'll go with that process. And now you'll see a chapter one down here, which is not zipped. So you have both files here. Okay, once you do that, you no longer need the zip file, so you might as well save space and delete that. And you go through the same exact steps for all these. Extract all, extract, chapter 3, extract all, extract, and then if you download 4 through 7, you'll go through the same exact steps again. Once again, we don't need these zip files anymore, so we can delete those. And now we have the folders here. So now if I go and open up Excel, and maximize it and I want to find a file on one of those folders I just made file open Look at flash drive chapter one uh, apply your knowledge there's that and uh, it comes up and this is the partially completed one all right <clears throat> so that's basically how you do that now um, what I'll put on the end of this too is 
how to save these things and, and how to set up folders if, if you want. All right. So uh, let me just minimize this for a second and come back here to your flash drive. So let's say I want to set up a folder here for um, Excel homework. So what you do is go down here to an empty space somewhere in this section, right click, new folder, and I want to call this CAS 170 homework. Okay. Now if I want to separate this even more and have like chapters within this, then I can double click that and open that. Right click, new folder, and then chapter one. Right click, oh, sorry, click new folder, chapter two. Right click, new folder, chapter three. Okay, and minimize that for a second. Go back to Excel. Okay, so I want to save this under my homework. All right, so I want to save this. Uh, save as apply one dash one and click on my flash drive, find my homework, chapter one, and save. All right, so let's just prove that works. Close this out, go back to my library, flash drive, for homework, chapter one, and voila, there it is. Okay, so I realized I sort of went through that fast. Um, however, the beauty of video is that you can watch it over and over again. You can have a, a viewing party with your friends if you'd like. Um, <clears throat> and uh, I do want to get it up to a million views, so watch it. You know, it, it means each, each of you have to watch it about mm, 75,000 times. So, appreciate that. And um, that is sort of that. So, thank you for listening, and goodbye.